What are we doing, Rick? I don't know, but let's do it. <laughs> hey, welcome back to our stupid reaction idiots. I'm Corbin. I'm Rick. And Instagram, you can follow us. And Twitter for more content. It's so it's juicy. Yeah. And follow us on our personal YouTube channels. Links on the description below. Ring the bell, the bell, the bell the notification squad. Bang! Thank you for listening on Patreon as well. I don't know if I said that. Did I say that? I don't think you did. Maybe but for those of you who skipped the intro, you missed something that was a time warp kind of a thing. And those of you who stayed there, it felt weird, didn't it? I missed it. Missed what? I don't know. Me too. <laughs> Anyways, uh, today is um, Onom? Yes, the Onom Festival. Yes. Is that what it's called? I believe, well, that's O-N-A-M, and I think that's how you pronounce it. Onam. Onam? Onam. Mm -hmm. uh, which I believe is a Kerala uh, it is. type festival. Right? Um, if I'm remembering all your beautiful messages, well, stupid babies. the happiest festival of Kerala. Yes. The Harvesting Joy uh, State, uh, State, State Festival, festival. of Kerala. Yes. Uh, I believe we reacted to something last year from this festival. I could be wrong, because we've gone a full year, so now... We've wrecked it to a lot of them. Did it have any? Was it was that when we did the thing with the, the food that was served on the banana leaf? I don't know. Maybe. Oh, but here you go. Uh, Onam, the official state festival of Kerala since 1960, is a 10-day harvest festival which started on August 22nd and ends on September 2nd. It's celebrated with joy and enthusiasm all over the state by Malayalese regardless of religion, caste, or creed. The festival commemorates the return of mythical king Mahabali, to see his beloved subjects at the beginning of Chingam, the first month of the Malayalam cal calendar. Malayalam. Malayalam. I can't believe <sighs> you messed that up again. Malayalam. What is the Malayalam calendar? What is wrong with you, Rick? It's a mammogram. What is wrong with you? Yeah, what is From it? the creator of Corbinizations. Uh, I am Corbinizations. <laughs> Let me see if that's weird. Okay. So. Okay. All right, cool. here, we, here we go. festival that is celebrated by all in Kerala, but as a concept, it has resonated differently at different times and regions, and voice. formed different styles. What is that, that, that evil elf in Lord of the Rings, what's her name, played by, uh, Once upon a time, oh, yeah. the <laughs> <Like> Onam <laughs> was celebrated in southern Kerala in the Malayalam month the of Kerala. Can't wait to come to Kerala in two years, years whenever we're allowed out of the United oh. States. Best believe we're going. As the name indicates, children's celebrations were given prominence, and it was only after they were yeah. served the traditional feast and fed to satisfaction that adults sat sure. down to eat. For the people of Srikakara, Onam wow, means the, the full month of festivities. <laughs> According to a Hindu myth, King Mahabali had his capital at Trikakara. <laughs> the 28 day long festival conducted at Trikakara temple has a thousand year old tradition. <laughs> The belief is that the great king's birthday is celebrated as Onam. We saw something. I remember the elephant. Is that the festival? With, with a huge amount of people that showed up. To I don't know if that's the same one. The Chamayam is a ritual that imparts a regal aura to Onam celebrations. Onam. Devotees believe that it marks the formal setting forth of the king from Tripunathara to participate in the Onam celebrations at Trikakara. <laughs> Public announcements are made about the event on Atta Chalayam Day and the celebrations <clears throat> end with a common feast for all as well as oh, the distribution dang. of Atta Banam. <laughs> 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 
Born on the scene as an agricultural festival too. As part of it, the choicest portion of agricultural produce is offered to the gods in a ritual called Kai Chikula Samarpanam wow, on wow. the eve of Onam or on Uttra. Say that, right? Really? <laughs> Tirvonatoni is another ritual. These names. Tirvonatoni is a boat in which the Karnavar of Kartun Mangadamana sends all the ingredients for the Onam feast to That's the beautiful. Parthasarathi temple at Aranmula. Wow. It was just everything so pretty. According to popular belief, Lord Krishna himself appeared in the form of a little boy in front of a patriarch of the golden days and demanded to wow. be fed. The Karnavar obeyed and people. this ritual has been taken forward by the succeeding generations. When Kartum Bhattathiri, accompanied by attendants and other boats, reaches Aramula with his decorated Thiruvonathoni laden with provisions. The natives of the area give him a loud and cheerful welcome. Is that Dora? It was. Wow. Is this the boat? boat race is also conducted annually. Did we do the boat festival last year? On this day? I think that's a... Is that the same day? Yeah, because I know the Kerala the Boat Festival. The is preceded by a procession of beautifully decorated snake boats. <laughs> Ornavilla is a special artifact that is placed as an offering at the sanctum of the Padmanabha Swami Temple at Thiruvananthapuram on the day of Ornam. It takes months to prepare the bow. Dang. All by hand? Devotees preserve wow. it in their homes, believing that it will bring luck to the family. Wow. Thiruvona Uta is a votive offering conducted at Mitralandapuram Ramanamurthy Temple in Trishur. Temple in another part of Kerala, Sri Dharma Shasta Temple at Shasta and Kotta and Kollam feeds monkeys on consecutive days of Uttaradam and Thirvona. Oh, they get the feast. Monkeys are happy. <laughs> <laughs> Hurry before they come. <laughs> exactly. It must be, I think that was probably one of the smaller ones who was afraid one of the big kids was coming. Northern Kerala. The arrival of King Mahabali is ritualistically announced at dawn by a Thayyam called Oneshwaram. He is utterly silent and for that reason he is also called Onapattan. Onathar is a Thayyam who appears on Uttaradam and Thirvonam days in Kannur. So beautiful. Ochira Thalagatta is a festival associated with the Parabrahma temple at Ochira. It is conducted on the 28th day after Onam. Oh, wow. A decorated pair of effigies of bulls is arrayed by each of the 52 localities at Onatugara, a region once famous for its agricultural wealth and known as the agrarian capital of Kerala. Dang! Look at all those. Today, it is a remnant of a ritual that celebrated the profusion of nature, a reminder of a time long past when the land yielded gold. 
Yeah, it and sounds a like the narrator of, of Lord of the Rings. That prosperity Which is Cape, Cape Blanchett. Yeah, yeah. The spirit of harmonious coexistence binds humans, the land, wow. and the power of Are those all handcrafted, I bet? Yep. I bet. Yep. Dang. My goodness. Car Every single time we see any video with Carol we see a Molly Allen film that's set in... It's one of the most gorgeous so places, beautiful. and I can't wait, because obviously the next time... <laughs> guys, people are like, come to India again. Guys, we're not allowed into any country right now. Yeah. I think we're allowed into like 20 countries, Yeah, and India is not one of them. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Right now, because uh, America is awesome. Um, but every single time I see it, it's so freaking gorgeous. Well, and we, we said, because people were wondering, you know, the stupid babies were wondering on our last trip when we would be back and where we would go. And we've basically, you know, we've said, okay, we started in this region, came down here, and then we're going to start from Mumbai and work yeah. our way down south. So, and I, I was, you know, we would love to come back next year, but we just, you, you can't make any plans right now, right now for anything because no. there's, we just got to wait <laughs> because to do it. It's so amazing that we were able to get the last trip in and do what we did because mm -hmm. we literally were able to get hugs and kisses and literally feeding you within a week before the planet shut down. No one fed. It was a week later and then everything went. <laughs> well, amazing. The uh, United States shut down two days after we got back. Yeah, two, two days. days after we got back. And while we were in India, they were saying, now they're not gonna start letting anybody Come in. They were starting to shut down the coming in. Yeah. So even our arrival, if we had scheduled it just two weeks later, we wouldn't have even been able to get there. So yes, that is the region of India. When we do it, it would be wonderful if we could do it in 2021. We'll see. <laughs> I don't know. But this looks awesome. Um, one, I don't know if they're all part of the same. Um, I'm guessing they're also the good the boat. And then you got those yeah. big things at the end. And you got the elephants. Over the course of those days. Because they said it lasts, what, 11 days or something? Like 10 that? days. 10 days? Yeah. That's crazy. Um, how long does it take? Because like we've seen, I, I forget what festival it is, but they craft these giant, I think they were almost like pyramid type things. Oh, there's um, every, every single festival they have, it seems, has something built that's either statuesque or a panel of some kind like Durga Puja. Um, well, yeah, they do a big statue thing for Durga Puja. Yeah, Durga Puja, they do pandals all over the place. Mm. It's just it's just everywhere you go is a new... And the pandals, I have not been in them because I haven't been there for Durga Puja yet, but the, the, the videos that I've seen, uh, they're, you walk into these things. They're like three times the size of your house yeah. that are made just for that year. <laughs> Every single time we see these festivals, we're always like... Because... Yeah. Obviously, we just don't have that here in America. No. Nope. You have a couple, you have Halloween, which is, a, it's not really a festival, it's just yeah. something that we do. On yeah, that it's, day. A, it's a big popular thing, but you don't, nobody builds anything other than a haunted house. Uh, obviously, Thanksgiving, but that's more um, to family, have some, having, family, have some food, have some food, and Christmas. Remember that Christmas you, is the biggest thing where there's decorations all over the city. But you still, like, people don't go to a place and like, it's like a season that no. you, you'll go see the Nutcracker, the, you'll go. Or you'll go to like Candy Cane Lane. There are neighborhoods that you'll go to and drive through because all of the homes are covered in lights. That's epic and beautiful, but it doesn't even come remotely close to the scale yeah. of what they do in India. Yep. Yep. We have no culture here in America. We. We stole it all. We. <laughs> our country's age. Yeah. We're younger than the city of Calcutta. The city of Calcutta is older than us. I think most things are older than this. Yeah, including you. It's true. You're I'm older than America. I'm older than America. I believe it. I actually was in Italy when I heard about Chris coming over here. And I kept telling everybody, he's a freaking moron. He didn't reach India. Would you stop calling him Indians? Also, he never reached America. No. Nope. He reached Cuba. Yep. And he raped. And started to rape and pillage and say... Hey, don't get me started on Chris. We're <laughs> Da din din 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 da din din